Hello guys, so I'm going to bring you here in our greenhouse and yeah, I'm doing some a little bit of improvement here. Not only that, I <laughs> starting on doing some a little bit of landscape and we do something on the path also which is cut idea. Yeah, so let's get inside. Okay guys, so let's get inside here. So last time I'm doing this mixing of this risol and this well another compost in here while I'm doing this part is where I'm going to do the repotting of the seeds, putting all the soil in the bags and yeah so this is how it looks now and last time when scott is not here because he was in the rental house manning the guy who is doing the mowing in there i am doing the work here whole day in the garden and i'm doing a little bit of landscape out of the bamboos so i cut these bamboos into small pieces with the saw and the axe <laughs> so look at this so this is how it looks now yeah so i put some in here like a little fence and i planted a flower i don't know that sense that is what available that i have so i just plant it and then i plant some aloe vera in there and i let the guy to get me some stump that one and i planted also that yellow color flower and in here also i have some more I put it on the top of the stump and that part yeah look at that it's really flowering and this part also I put some little fins in here just little by little and yeah I'm doing also the planting of that flowers but I don't have yet enough aloe vera I'm still growing some so I can transplant it here and last time when Scott is here, I keep on pulling all those weeds all around and especially in here and then he's asking, why you pull out those grass? I said, I don't want to look the greenhouse inside look dirty, but he said, we're planning to put some bags of cement in there with the gravel. I said, yeah, but I like to pull it out, then you can put the bags of cement and the gravel afterwards so yes we go back here guys look at this my friends gave this to me to be planted here and he said and she said if it grows she gonna give me more some and this radish I used to plant this one this one is easily grow yeah in the rental house so in the time I harvest it there's a lot so we give it away to our friend and look at my pichai guys the pichai is a family of cabbage i think yeah and i gonna transplant all of this in the pots or even in our garden beds and this one is the beans but it's really growing that big so i already transplanted this one already and this is the tomato look at this they start growing already and maybe a week i gonna transplant it and here is the bell pepper it's quite a lot growing also yeah and this part oh some in here are the cucumber but there is a mix with Pichai. and this is the lady's finger what we called okra that I gonna transplant it then one of our guys her going to give me some eggplant but I have planted some seedlings of eggplant here and look at this guys I transplanted some of the pichai and look at that they're really growing big see if I'm going to harvest this, I can share it some to my friends. Wow. And last time also, with these hanging plants, I 
they're really growing big down longer so I cut it and retransplanted it here in each pot and this one I guess I'm gonna cut this and transplant this one and also in here so I guess yeah this one is vacant I guess I can transplant more it's easy though to plant I like it when there's a lot of plants especially in this garden side okay I'm gonna get more anyway this one will easily grow no problem with that I like to grow this a lot because I'm planning to make a hanging plants with the use of those metal that is left over when our workers doing the garage and I trying to grow this kind of flower and make also a hanging plants out of it yeah but look at my flowers I wonder why in the garden oh no in the rental house it's really growing big and there's a lot of leaves but in here I wonder why I'm gonna look and see what's wrong with it and this one also no more leaves look at this oh my but this one I gonna transplant it I gonna transfer it to the soil so it really grow big and it really gives a lot of flowers and it's so like to nice to see it when there's a lot of flowers blooming yeah and There are some weeds growing in here easily and now it's growing easily especially when it's keep raining but easily to pull up because they're inside the pots I'm gonna take all those out I just put it together I guess no more and look at this one in here those are when I use everything all the bamboo that I cut last time in this place I get some more bamboos and I cut it yeah I cut it in this size so I can use this one outside and maybe I let the guy to cut me some three two or three stamps for the outside so I can design it also yeah so these are the This one guys I gonna use this one for the pot so the grass won't grow like this one in here I have planted also some more peach chai plant and it's growing look at those but I gonna transfer some of it when it's quite bigger already I transfer it to the other racing beds and some in the pots of I gonna make it into a hanging also and this one is they started growing already huh these are tomato and that side is the this one oh they start growing also so this one is the bell paper this one is vacant because I'm planning to plant more ginger or garlic this is the scallion or the onion and this one is a other ginger and i grow some more ginger in here i took it from the store <laughs> when we bought some we bought some ginger when there is some part is growing so i just planted it here and look at this start growing so when it's a little bit bigger I gonna transplant it to the racing beads yeah and look at this gumamila guys they are growing already they're blooming flowers already yes and in here these are the seeds that I grown that I grown and now I transplanted it already in this line in the middle look at those over there 
Okay, look at this, guys. So I just have planted all the beans that I grown up, and I think it's ready to climb now. <laughs> Not only in the middle, but also I planted in the some part in the side. So look at those. See, I think they are ready to climb. So I gonna. I will tell Scott that we might put some string in here so across and then from the ground up going to the other side we, so we're gonna use a straw or a nylon and also this part these are all beans that I transplanted yesterday look at those Those are all beans, and those are all beans going down there. And this one, but not really growing yet. I wonder why. Oh, this one is, I planted some, oak, no, I planted some eggplant in here. Yeah, but in each end of the racing beds, from here, in there, and each in the other end, I planted some marigold for anti-bugs. It is like a bug repellent. Yeah, maybe you wonder why, guys, how it looks now. Yeah, so this is cut idea, by the way, that we put this bag of cement in here. And then after that, we put the gravel on the top so the grass won't really grow in the path. And it's not slippery. And it looks like neat and clean. So every time I do the mixing and edge bed, I take out all those grass. Then we pile the, this bag of cement. Then we put gravel. It's not yet done. We need a lot more of bag of cement to put in in this line over there all around. Even when you enter. Yeah. So we need a lot of gravel also. Okay guys, I'm going to use this cement bag to lay on each pad. So we can get ready also to put all the gravels all around the rising beads. Okay, so I just finished putting some of the bag of cement but I, I am waiting for more which is available that they are not using or the one that is broken so I gonna use it in here I need a lot more and yeah especially in those vacant place so all of this I gonna put some bag of cement I went under those under over there we're gonna put some more yeah so after i gonna work inside in here outside the greenhouse guys this one i gonna pull out though because this one i just use this because i'm going to let this flower grows and this part i gonna dig and crack the soil and prepare it then I make some landscape. I guess three, yes, three stamp that I let the guy to cut. I put it one, 
two, three, and in here I make a design. And then the little bamboo things I gonna use. Then plant some maybe vegetable or bell pepper or flowering plants. I don't know yet. What do you think that I gonna plant it in this part? Yeah. Okay guys, thanks for viewing our channel. Please do like, comment, share, and subscribe.